I've been able to show a much more vulnerable, sensitive, different version of myself than on reality TV. One of the things I wanted to ask you, because you just said, you know, obviously distancing yourself from the persona that you created, it has also been a challenge in itself. What is the biggest difference between Johnny Bananas Key West and Challenge versus Johnny Bananas Host? I mean, I, 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 I said, so, I mean, I, I, I you know, I, kind of made some of the points, but I think the most important one is, I guess, a lot, my character, my persona, whatever you want to call it, my on-air personality on the challenge, a lot of it was created based on the environment that I was in. So the challenge environment forces you to be a certain way, especially if you're going to be successful. For me, that was, you need to go on and you need to put on a suit of armor right you have to go on and and um because you're gonna be i mean you're you're in, in 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 like they say there's no honor amongst thieves right you're in a you're in a lion's den and everybody there is trying to get a leg up on you constantly and they're always trying to figure out you know how to strategically or, or whatever get rid of you and i almost created this really in your face, loud, over the top, sarcastic um, personality as a way to like keep people at a distance, right? So if they're interacting with this larger than life, in your face, loud, boisterous personality version of myself, they're not getting to me because the person that I really am, believe it or not, despite what you may see on TV, is actually pretty like sensitive guy, you know, I'm, I, I have emotions too. I have a heart, despite what a lot of people may think. And I always use my sense of humor and my sarcasm as a way to keep people at a distance. With hosting and, and, and you know, first look and now celebrity sleepover, the point is to get the most you can, the most authentic, the realest version of the guests that you're having. And you can't do that by always being a jokester or always cracking jokes or always being sarcastic. It's almost like you have to get on their level. And I've been able to show a much more vulnerable, sensitive, different version of myself than on reality TV. And I'm, I'm not gonna say it's been a struggle, but it's just been different. It's been, it's been weird being able to like let my guard down and be like okay with being that version of myself the version that like my family knows my girlfriend knows close friends of mine that i've known forever know um so that's been mostly it it's just been like you know being able to again uh, let my guard down a little bit and change and 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 recalibrate you know what it means to, to 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 be on tv and again not be the center of attention and not you know constantly absorbing all the oxygen in the room and, and and again being being interested not interesting it's 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 taking some time so this is the real this is the real johnny bananas yeah i wouldn't say i mean <laughs> it's not to say listen it's not to say that who you see on the challenge isn't the real me i mean that's the real me that's just a much more colorful version of me that's the always on version of me i do have an off switch right and i think so, like, again celebrity sleepover while there, I still, trust me, It's you're gonna get your doses of bananas, but you're also, again, going to see, at times, a much different, much much more, uh, much more, you know, serious, I guess, buttoned up, even though I'm wearing pajamas, which are usually unbuttoned. Um, more of a buttoned up version of myself. Uh, and, and again, it's, 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 it's been cool because what, it, what it's enabled me to do is, I had the, I know how to be reality TV. I know how to be Johnny Bananas on the challenge and I know how to be that guy. What I didn't know how to be is the host. You know what I mean? That's more well-rounded and, and has, I feel like now I have more arrows in my quiver. You know what I mean? Before I was just like a one trick pony and now I have the ability to to branch out and, and, and you know, be a different version of myself and not everything has to be a comeback or sarcastic or something like that and, and a really good piece of advice that, that that i had gotten and from from other hosts that i've watched like anthony bourdain and mike rowe and you know even and like you know i love the miz as well is especially with the host if this person's always cracking jokes it's like you're not going to take anything to do or say seriously so a well-timed joke occasionally helps 
let, helps the information go down. Um, and they land a lot better. And, and that, again, that's been, you know, something that I've had to learn as well.